I owe you guys honesty and it's finally time that I come out and tell you guys the truth. Part of me just feels so guilty and ashamed. I'm no longer single. I met somebody and honestly in a really, really happy relationship. It has been way too long since I've seen your guys' faces. I have not posted on YouTube in 278 days. This is the longest break I've ever taken since I've started social media. So the question is, why did I stop? I think I'm gonna set you guys up right here. This should be good. I am so happy to announce that today's video is sponsored by CapCut. Literally, thank you guys so much for. What the heck? There's like something breaking into the house. Who are you? I'm the owner of this house. No, because I'm the owner of the house. Okay, look, well, I literally don't have time for this. Dude, just get out of here. Chill. Take a chill go, man. You're just mad that I'm better looking than you're up. Okay? Oh, you look the same! Alright, you literally got so like, get out! Okay, okay, I'll leave. Okay, so I obviously don't have an identical twin. No, I wish I did. But with the power of the CapCut editing app, we all could have twin siblings. If you guys didn't know, CapCut is actually created by the same development team behind TikTok, so it actually became my editing app of choice for my TikToks. I really love it because it's a free all-in-one editing app. It literally has everything that you could need. So I'm sure you've seen that viral trend on TikTok with the 3D picture image thing, but what you guys probably didn't know is all the creators created that with CapCut with basically the touch of a button. It's super easy to use. You just choose your image. It can literally make your photo 3D and have motion. Overall, the app is super user friendly and they have a huge library of effects, filters, stickers, sounds, so much. If you name it, they have it. You can download CapCut in the description down below. It is available for iOS and Android users so everyone can enjoy this amazing app. Also, if you end up making some videos with it, I would love to see them. Tag me in them so I can see it. But let's get back to the regular programming. For some reason, this is like one of the hardest videos I've ever filmed. Oh, a part of me just feels so guilty and ashamed of why I've waited so long to come out and say this. Oh, I just need to just like let it out and just say it and get it off my chest and finally move on. I have never opened up about this, not to my family or nor to my closest friends because I just truly just don't ever want anyone really concerned about my well being. So when I stopped posting on social media, I didn't really give an explanation of why I stopped, I just completely stopped. And I did that because I just truly did not think anyone would really care. But that all changed when I started to get messages and comments and DMs and emails about where I've been and why I've been so inactive and essentially why I stopped posting on YouTube. After a lot of thought, I've now realized that I truly owe you guys an explanation and for me to be completely open and honest. So pretty much to give like a whole backstory of like why I stopped posting and why I quit YouTube, we have to go back to why I left LA. When I left LA a year ago, I was in a very, very dark place. Not only was I leaving LA because it was just a very toxic environment for me, and put me through a lot of depression, but I was also going through a breakup as you guys know. And I think just the combination of these two things when I left LA and the breakup, it was just a lot to handle. So much so that I physically could not take it anymore. So as I'm trying to figure out why I'm feeling the way I'm feeling, I am still posting on YouTube. I did a few videos, not very many. It wasn't until my house tour that I realized that I just was not happy posting on YouTube anymore. It was because of me truly inside and I've just pushed it away and kept it dormant for so long and ignored the fact that I really needed to work on myself. So I took it upon myself to take a break from YouTube for my mental health because I was very sad and just very lost. I was truly having an identity crisis. That is why my hair was orange. 
Um, that is why I literally left LA. That is why just so many things happened. I didn't even realize that I was going through an identity crisis. The problem is, is when I started social media, I was 16 years old, maybe even 15. I am now 22, almost 23 years old. And throughout my entire career on social media and YouTube, I have just kind of kept this personality of myself that I was when I was younger. I thought that's how I had to be to entertain you guys. And I was just so afraid to really show my true self on camera like I am right now because ultimately my hyper over the top crazy exaggerated self is truly me and that was once 100% me. I dragged that on for many many years and it became to the point that I was literally portraying to be my younger self. So essentially I have evolved and I've matured a lot and I'm still definitely crazy wild and hyper and oh my god what's up I'm definitely like that but it's just not all the time and not everything is perfect in my life and not everything is crazy and wild and I really would like to show the reality of my life. So throughout this whole 10 month process of figuring out who I am going through therapy and so much and just working on myself essentially, I have now found my truest and authentic self and that is who I want to be online and that's who I want to show you guys. But I just want to say that I am now finally so happy for the first time in my life in so long. And within this whole break from YouTube, I have not only worked on myself, but I've actually kind of gotten back into the dating scene. So when you guys last saw me in my last video, I was single and sad, but now in the present day, I am happy to say that I am no longer single and I'm in a happy relationship. After my last breakup, I never thought I would ever be in a healthy relationship. I just truly believed I was gonna be alone forever, but that is not the case. If you'd like to meet who I'm dating, um, let me know in the comments down below. But to answer the big, huge question is, Am I okay? <laughs> yes, I'm obviously okay. And I'm doing so much better from the last time that you guys saw me. I just wanna thank you guys from the bottom of my heart to every single one of you guys who has supported me and subscribed to this channel and just been here from the beginning or not from the beginning, just in general, your support means the world to me. And I just cannot thank you enough for you all. So yeah, that is pretty much why I left YouTube. I'm just really excited to be my new mature self on here and not be afraid to show you guys my life. Anywho, I'm rambling so much, but if you guys are new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe down below and give this video a big thumbs up. And I will see you guys in the next video. I have no idea what my new posting date is gonna be, but just know more videos to come. I love you. <laughs>